Good evening, Lady Elegance. Good evening, Mrs. And how are you this evening? You're looking wonderful. You're glowing. You're looking bright. But guess what? I had to throw you in the hot seat tonight. Was there a reason? Because I was quite surprised when you pulled me again. I thought to myself, hold on, why is she calling me again to go into the hot seat <laughs> again? And basically, this is something that you could actually do yourself because you're a fantastic motivational speaker. I know, but I like to stay behind the screen at times. Okay. Yeah. And this question that we were asked to touch on, Mm -hmm. I know you're the right person to answer it. Oh, really? Yes. <laughs> but that means it's spicy. It is. Okay, I understand that. I really do. I like your mic. Thank you. You know me, bling bling. You to a team, my sister. There we go. <laughs> Only somebody who knows me knows that. Oh, yeah. And don't I know you very well? Oh, definitely. Definitely. Me and you are what we call friends. For life. For life. That's right, my sister. Amen. Amen, my sister. Preach it, my sister. Preach Amen. it. Amen. <laughs> right. One of our followers okay. has asked us to touch on this specific topic. And the topic is friendship versus man. Ah. I'm sure you love that one, don't you, Lady definitely, Elegance? Definitely, definitely. Uh, yes, I can but see that. Definitely, because, you know, really and truly, you, from you have a loyal friend, you are not supposed to question that friendship. No. Over no man, even though you find, okay, I understand we need a man in our life, definitely, definitely. But at the same time, you have to remember that loyal friend that you've got but when you have but you do have women that the minute they get a man they forget about a friend that always has to bail them out of bad relationships yes okay i'm ready for this you call those friends man clowns well okay right okay now this follower okay has got a friend right. who she's a she the follower has always been there we're gonna call her follower miss p yeah okay miss p miss miss p miss s yes okay miss p is a friend okay miss s is the follower okay our follower okay now miss p has found has been friends with Miss S for years. Okay. And Miss S has always been there for Miss P. Okay. Through thick and thin. Right. Bad relationships, mix up, blend up, Toss you up. name them. Oh, yes, my sister, you name them. Okay, I hear that. Now, Miss P has found this man, <laughs> new man. Okay. And she has actually dumped Miss S because she's found a new man now. Right. So she wants to have nothing to do with Miss S. <laughs> so she's asked us to touch on that topic for her. Why is it that when you've got a friend and that friend find a man, that friend tend to switch? Like a radio station Shemai. on you. <laughs> I'm awfully sorry, but I find this to be such. Do you know something? Yes. Just last week I did a show last week similar to this. Totally, totally similar to this. I'm going to answer this in our one. Shakaki Friday. I'm awfully sorry about that. I have to. I'm oh, awfully sorry. You know, you do have some women that the minute they find a new man, then forget about, they forget, totally, totally forget about who's been there for them. But sure. you know, they're the one that's lying down, taking it to battle, 
Right. Yeah. When the man start beat, the man start kick them like a football. Mm -hmm. They want to pick up the front, the phone and call the friends. This <laughs> misses. Dial tone. You dial tone that. Exit. You know my favorite. You know my favorite word. Exit. Exit. I that. totally agree. There we go. We ain't got time for that. Come on. No. Listen to me, misses. You have been a loyal friend to this Miss P. Miss P, Miss E, Miss D. You might as well give it a full length of the full length of the, the alphabet. Because from what I can gather, I'm trying to put to be I'm trying to like trying to put the picture together here. It comes like every time she takes up a man, she's always dropping it. Like Yes. Like, and um, when like that man bread, starts like treating her bad, then she picks up the phone. She, and that's right. It. No, this is time now. We're coming into 2016 now, and Lady Elegance is telling you this. Drop her. Listen to me. You need to delete. You need to unfollow. You need to block. You need to untwitter. You need. <laughs> you need to untwitter. You need to unmessenger. You need to unfacebook. Every single one of the networks that she's on. Exit. Exit. And you know from Lady from Lady from Lady Elegance says exit. We mean every single one of the exit them. That's right. I hope Miss S I've answered your question for you. Next question. Well um at the end of the day this friend I don't know because I've never been in a situation like that before. Neither have I, because I always believe when you have a friend, a friend, especially a loyal friend. That's right. Good friends are very, very hard. Very to hard find. to find. And when you do find a friend that is very, very loyal to you, that's right. You better hold on to that friend. Yes. Because listen to me, friends are so hard to find. Genuine, true friends. Me and Suzette are close. She is a very loyal friend. I am a very loyal friend. That's to her. right. I would never put nothing or nobody in front of her. I am married. Suzette is not. Me, Suzette, and my husband, we're one complete network. Oh yeah. My husband don't get involved in the work that me and Suzette does. Never has. But at the same time, he will listen to the videos and say, well, and he will try and put in his little piece where he can. Do you yes, me? Yeah. But at the end of the day He supports us in a big way, he does. But listen, a loyal friend in this era is very, very difficult to find. Very hard. It's very, very hard. It's very, very hard. Because see right now when you find friends now, you're getting fake oh, yeah. friends. You're getting backstabber friends. Yes. You're getting friends that's hugging you up and every single day, but you're what? As you turn your back, they're stabbing you in it, and it's it's horrible. You you you're getting opportunists. That is horrible. friends as well. That is really bad. And Miss S, I am so sorry that you have to endure that. But hear what? It's about time you allow her to fall on her face now, okay? And when, don't be there to pick up the pieces. Because when rem I remember one thing, you know, you see when at the end of the day you're there picking up the pieces, I share the one that's taking the bad cocky in you. I hope I've answered the question for you. See you on the next segment. See ya. Bye.